Okay. This is the Hyper Battalion Generation Shockwave. Before I put any of the Toy Hacks labels on. And these are the labels. Little butterfingers there. Eh? Okay, so this is how it looks before I put any new label the new labels on. Okay, now for the labels. Okay, here is Shockwave with all the labels on. starters you get that there a little cannon air section light for that okay now first of all these section is labels here but these here because they needed something here but these were alternates for right here I chose this here because I like this. And these are like little extra things. I guess windows. Or something. In, in this mode. Knock over one, knock over the other. So in this mode it's supposed to be some a ship, so. I guess that's windows seem appropriate. And here, this down here, there's some little decals that make it actually look nice. Okay, back here, they give you some thruster decals. And they give you decal to cover up if, if you look at this area and put any any other type of decal you want on. I chose to leave it blank because it looks better. And they give you these here. They also give you these wing decals here and over here. These Decepticon symbols you can pretty much you can put anywhere you want. I chose here. Because in jet mode, that's, it looks good that way. And they give you an optional gray or black. I chose the black. And put this extra red dot, lit eye dot here. Alright.
all the things to lock in securely. Now here they give you four, uh, three alternates. I like this one because it's a G1 ish. And as you can see, instead of putting a Decepticon label up here for and Robama, I put one right here, which is G1 ish. And a shockwave appropriate. Now they also get, now they give you these shoulder decals as well. And the stylet one. And they give you a golden uh, yellow uh, decal for the put over the eye. You can see how that looks. So now this G this looks like G1. -ish. Also, here on the legs they give you decals for those. And they're all very reflective. So now, it looks really nice. And it looks a lot more G1 accurate. So, that's it. Now, the one, one last thing I did was paint this still a nice metallic color, silver color. You can see it catches the light really good. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching.